Staff Sergeant Rollins. I'm with Tennessee National Guard out of Union City, Tennessee with 913th ECC. We're here now in Unicoi County, Arwen, Tennessee. We're doing cleanup from the natural disaster, the flood waters that come through here. They destroy this town. We're eager to get to work and help all these families reclaim this land, reclaim their home. We have now cleared about roughly 200 yards of debris out ditches. I'd say with us, in between us and all the civilians out here, we've definitely cleared over 150 dump truck loads. We're utilizing heavy equipment as far as high axes, dump trucks, loaders, dozers. We will continue to work and do anything the team needs us to help them with and the governor and the state of Tennessee.
My name is Benjamin Harrison. I'm a uh, horizontal engineer, 12 November. The basis of what we do is simply, uh, particularly on this mission, we go out, we've been provided with route clearance, so our job is to, at first, make sure we have a one-lane path for EMS, fire, police, you know, whoever needs to get in and out, as well as to get the civilians a way to get to points of distribution. Um, make sure they can get food, water, whatever they need to have. We uh, set up two different teams. We have our route clearance, which is a little bit heavier. They usually have equipment um, known as an iHemi. It's a front-end loader with a backhoe on the back. Um, and then, of course, teams like myself are strike teams. We're assigned to go out um, as quickly as possible, clear routes, identify things we can't clear, you know, things that are just too big, power lined, whatnot, that requires assistance with uh, Georgia Power and with our actual route clearance teams. Um, in particular, we've done a lot of humanitarian and um, helping people get out of their driveways, be able to get their medicine, um, helping link up with fire departments for oxygen, just doing our best as we can to help the community. Okay, um, my unit's based out of Columbus. I was in Florida when I got the call. I was on vacation. Um, Step foot off the cruise ship, grabbed my bag from my truck, came straight here. Um, in immediate reaction, I enlisted in the Georgia Army National Guard, in particular for the 12 November class, um, which is a heavy equipment operator, to assist with things like hurricanes. So I overjoyed. Um, most of the time, it's not as bad as we think. We show up, we do what we can, we leave. This time, unfortunately, we had to do as much as we can to help the community, and we're happy we could be here. I think I can speak for all of my team that we've wanted nothing to do but get out first thing in the morning and come back as late as possible. Okay, what are, what are some of the biggest challenges you've encountered while helping out with this situation? Uh, I feel like we aren't doing enough. I mean, it doesn't matter how long, how far, how much we clear, how many people we help. It just, you turn around, there's always someone else, and it feels like there's just not enough. But, you know, we have everyone here. We're doing as much as we can. I think our leadership's pleased with what we're doing. Hopefully the community's pleased with what we're doing. And, uh, you know, it's just that, that human drive to want to help people. I think that it's been a very rewarding experience. It's, you know, like I said, it's particularly why I enlisted, why I joined. My, my family has a very heavy history of military service. Um, you know, I think uh, one of our favorites was being able to clear a driveway for a lady to get out and uh, go get her heart meds because she had a surgery that she had to have skipped, unfortunately, due to the hurricane and the medicine's what she needed to be able to, you know, stay up until she can have that surgery. So I think our team was very proud of that one.